Hey young scientist, want to learn about the cell membrane and the cell wall? I know you did. First, why don't we start with the cell membrane? The cell membrane exists in animal cells and in plant cells, while the cell wall only exists in plant cells, fungi, and some prokaryote cells, which are cells that exist as an individual cell and do not have a nucleus, such as bacteria. The cell membrane acts in a similar way to the skin of the human body. The skin helps protect and cover your bones and organs, and the cell membrane helps protect the different parts that live in and make up the cell. The cell membrane also helps control the movement of particles and, stu- and substances that travel in and out of the cell, meaning that it is semi-permeable. Let's see how a cell membrane is made. A cell membrane is made of two layers of fat and protein, called lipids. The use of the bilayer lipids is to provide structure to the cell and to fix itself when it is torn. Let's talk about the cell wall now. The cell wall is mentioned only exists in plant cells. The cell wall is several micrometers in thickness, which is very strong and rigid. The cell wall wraps around the cell membrane, providing more support and protection from, for the cell. The cell wall is made of cellulose, fiber, and proteins. Cellulose is made of atoms, carbons, hydrogen, and oxygen. Without the cell wall, a cell would not be able to work normally and may die any second. The cell wall protects the membrane from being damaged and prevents the cell from collision. Therefore, the cell membrane and the cell wall are very important. Well, I hope you learned a lot. Bye!